Hey everybody, I'm back. It's Rob from Heart and Soil Farms. Um, today, what we're going to show you is we're going to be doing an expansion on our pig pen area. Um, we were recently limited to the amount of pallets we were able to access because uh, that's what we previously built most of it with. And this particular size has been hard to get a hold of because we, we had all these donated to us so we didn't have to pay anything for it so it's a free pig pen. Um, but recently I came across a location that has the same kind of pallets and they were more than glad to give me some so now we're able to expand upon and add on to the uh, existing pen. We're going to break it up into a couple different paddocks you know, so if we need to separate the pigs we can. Um, sooner or later we're going to get them to have some little piglets so uh, we need to separate them, keep some room, keep him over there, keep the babies over here, vice versa. But uh, we're going to be rearranging some things, and I've kind of got this thing lined out the way it's going to be. As you guys see, their existing paddock is pretty good size, but uh, I don't know. We like to give them the luxury suite, I guess, so we're going to do an expansion. Um, what we're going to do here is take this section out in the middle, and uh, we're going to put a gate across right here in the middle. Keep a wall on this side and a wall on this side. Put a gate there so we can access back and forth or shut it off, leave it open, whatever. But uh, the way we did it previously, you know, we got them all, well, that's going to change. But uh, we got them all tied together. We had some rebar that we beat down in there that kind of held them in place so that whenever the pigs nudge up against them, they can't move the pallets. Plus, it's already pretty stable. So um, we're going to be putting probably two by fours that join the pallets together from here to here and there to there so uh, that's also going to tie them together real well but we're basically just going to open that up right there and expand upon it around the outside i just got them sitting up here they're not fastened or anything they're just sitting and uh, it'll just wrap on around we may be putting a gate in here not sure probably will but uh, that meets right up against the barn and then over here we got our little walkway to be able to get through the chicken coop and keep the chickens going that direction. But uh, a little L shape here. There's some shingles we got left from the barn barn build. But uh, and then it'll just meet right up to the existing wall right here. And uh, they got a little walkway on down through there. But uh, that's basically the gist of it, guys. And uh, we'll get some more straw in here. A couple feeders. I think it's going to look good. They're going to be happy with it. I'd be happy with it if I was a pig, but I'm not, so. All right. Just like that guys, it's together. Gotta put a couple put a couple door hinges on and get this thing closed up, get some straw in here, let them loose. There's also been some new additions to the farm we'd like to show you guys. Let's go take a look. Alright guys, as you know, this is our big girl clover. And this is who is this, Mandy? Willow. <laughs> I feel like we got so many animals. There's Willow. And then we got Winchester. Winchester, big boy. And our newest addition. She's our other little breeder, Cooney girl. This is Hazel. She's such a sweetheart. She's such a sweetheart. So that's one of our new additions. Oh, Hazel. We got her just the other day. Let's go check out the other new addition. All right, guys, and for our last edition, this is a big one. Our new girl, Mrs. Shelby. Mrs. Shelby. She's our Great Pyrenees. Everybody's getting the Great Pyrenees these days, but uh, they're an awesome dog. 
and she's going to make an awesome addition to our family. Everyone loves her so much. Even the Nook loves her. They love to play together. The cats are still a little bit not too sure, but uh, it's going to be awesome. We need somebody to watch over all those chicks we got. All right, guys, it's all together. It's a couple days later. Uh, we let everybody kind of settle in. Looks like everybody's loving it. What do you think? What do you think, Winchester? What do you think, big boy? Biggest thing of all, what do you think, sweetheart? Everybody good? Look who's back there. Clover. She's a standalone rebel these days. But, uh... It's all finished up. We got everything fastened together. We got that opening done. I got to decide on what we're going to use for a gate. And uh, I'm going to get some hinges right here. We're going to put the opening here. But uh, overall, everybody seems to be pretty happy. Happier than pigs and slop, right? Hey, there's plenty of room for everybody. Make way, make way. We got a little inclement weather here that just changed in the last couple of days. <laughs> a little bit of a little ice going on. But uh, next project, Jenny. Okay, thank you. Next project we're doing, we're going to be kicking in chicken in. <laughs> next project we're going to be doing, we're going to be getting into this uh, chicken coop and opening it up for all these other hens we got. So uh, stay tuned for that. Let's take a peek inside, see how everybody's doing, shall we? Oh. Hey everybody. Just checking on you. Make sure everybody's good. Wow, looks like everybody's good. Where's the turkey? Turkey turkey. We got baby turkey in here too. She's in here somewhere. So we, got, we got 71 birds in here, guys. That's crazy. Well, it's crazy for me anyway. There's Turkey. She's a lone turkey bird right now. We got some in the incubator. Hopefully we'll have some more coming. But uh, All these babies seem to be growing well into their wings. It's about time to get them outside. And, uh, well, first things first. I gotta get that coop done. Well guys, all of us here, Heart and Soil Farms, we appreciate you whenever you you watch us and uh, leave your comments for us. And uh, as the season progresses, we're going to have more and more content for you. And uh, thanks for following along. Everybody have a great day. Thank you. What do you think, Bernard? Bernard?